Grand Rising. What's up, y'all? You all have tapped in with Black Goddess Intuitive Healer, and I'm here to bring you all messages for the sign of Virgo, all placements. So if you happen to have Virgo anywhere in your birth chart, these messages could resonate for you and your situation. Use your intuition and discernment when getting readings. Okay, everything, <clears throat> everything that's being said in the reading may not resonate for you. Okay. So take what resonates for your particular situation and leave the rest, all right? I hope you all are taking care of yourselves. Y'all know my motto. Nurturing is very important on this journey, okay? Make sure y'all are taking care of yourselves. Seeing a lot of y'all are standing alone, okay? A lot of endings. A lot of people are like single, Virgo. Like a lot of y'all are single. It's shit right now, okay? Okay? I feel like a lot of y'all had to be with the particular mission that y'all had. Y'all had to stand alone. I'm hearing learning lessons in independence and being independent, Virgo. Things of that nature. Um, coming out of codependency. So a lot of y'all have persevered through a lot of different things that y'all had trouble with throughout this lifetime, Virgo. So take it as it resonates. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, y'all, to the channel. Yeah, Virgo. <clears throat> Some a few of y'all needing to speak up to somebody. Or just speak up, period. Some of y'all could be, like, shy. Quiet or something. That's odd, but that's what I'm getting. Some of y'all could be, um, just for a few of y'all could be um, coming out of trying to have, well, coming into, not out of, but like out of old beliefs and trying to have some type of faith in y'all situations, okay? Benevolent ancestors, come in at this time, protect our energy and our aura as I channel messages for the sign of Virgo. Somebody could be gossiping about y'all at this time, Virgo. Okay, do not engage into gossip. That's low vibrations. It's low energy. And it take your energy as well when you gossip. You don't got time. Somebody is definitely gossiping about y'all. Somebody, it could be a person who could be gossiping about you wanting to be single or you being single here. So take it as it resonates. Somebody could be obsessing. I feel like if somebody is seeing a side of you, Virgo, that they've never seen before. And this person could think you conceited and or cocky. Take it as it resonates. Okay. All right. So this particular energy could be trying to come in and cause some type of distraction here. It says keep going. It's a distraction. So Virgo, this person that you might have had some type of connection here with. They're saying that this person is um, going to come back from the dead. Okay. This is something you've already killed off and ended. Had a mental funeral and everything. Literally had a mental funeral. I'm hearing like you cut family members off. You, <laughs> you removed yourself completely from a situation, Virgo. You may have loved this person, but shit, ha shit was getting too heavy for you. I feel like shit getting heavy for this person. It says, I can't get you out of my mind. You stay in my energy. So this person is thinking about y'all heavy right now, Virgo, okay? Like, this per day and night. Like, I feel like this person watches you in some type of way, Virgo. They could stalk your house. I feel like this person could see you living a new life here, living in living in your truth and embracing a new beginning. I can see here that they already know, like, they really, I, I can get that y'all not paying attention to shit. Like, it's a tunnel vision to the bullshit. So, y'all really focusing on yourselves, y'all in y'all confidence, y'all are standing in y'all confidence, and that's beautiful energy, Virgo. Okay, so y'all still, the answer is still no. That's what the ancestors are saying. So this energy could be trying to come in. I feel like this person could definitely be missing out on you, Virgo. 
But the situation with this person was never serving a purpose here. It said it never served its purpose. Stop caring about it. So, yeah, you could still care about this person, Virgo. Okay, this person could still care about you. I feel like it was hard for y'all to master detachment from this energy. It was some type of addiction here. And or a very strong soul tie I'm getting. I feel like y'all allowed y'all spirit to guide you away from this situation because I'm getting that it was toxic and messy as hell. Okay, so y'all got a new y'all got a new relationship relationship here. So I feel like Virgo, this person was not showing who they really were in a relationship with you. I feel like they kept you at bay in different things in your life. Like, th different things that this person could have been involved in and or engaged in or different things of that nature. This person was not being honest about who they were. It says, this relationship is fake. Nobody is happy. Okay, so I feel like you were... I don't, I don't feel like it was a lot of happy moments with this energy. Okay, so I do feel like the love was strong and it could have been because of the passion, sex, lust. So... I feel like your person could have confused lust and love. I feel like that's the way they showed that they loved you, Virgo, by having like what, some good dick or something like that. Excuse my French. But yeah, you got a new um, exclusive relationship here. So I feel like that's what y'all have manifested, okay? I feel like you and this new person could be manifesting each other. Y'all are about to come into union here or connection or y'all about to meet. It's something about to happen here. It's a lot of big stuff about to happen here, Virgo. So be patient. If y'all ain't already met this person, okay? And or take this energy as it resonates. It says this relationship is fake. So your person could be in a relationship where it's just like, ain't nobody happy. It's like, why are we here? So I feel like y'all already know. That's why y'all not paying attention to shit. Because everybody, people trying to move in ways where they think it's going to affect you in some type of way. But y'all like, we already a million steps ahead of y'all prepped <laughs> Virgo okay so you already know this person your ex your past person this person is definitely not happy with whoever they with this person yearning for you like literally yearning I don't care what black magic spell this person this person whoever this person called themselves being with I don't care how much black magic they threw on this person that person was still thinking about you whether it was good or bad, they still wanted to come your way, Virgo. Okay? It's a y'all got some type of strong hold or something, Virgo. Okay? I'm getting past lives. Y'all had several past lives. That's why this connection could feel intense. Like, even the separation part could feel intense, too. You know what I'm saying? I feel like can't no black magic stop what the real feelings are. I don't care how much a person hid themselves on how they really feel about you, for, and especially to other people. I don't care how much they've been hiding it. This person been yearning for you. I'm definitely getting that. This person could be proud of you. I feel like they are proud of you. Somebody wants to talk, Virgo. And yet you're not even concerned, yet they want you to be so bad. So I feel like somebody could be trying to do something here to cause some type of um emotional issue or something for you, Virgo. It's a waste, <clears throat> excuse me, it's a waste of time. This some shit you don't even got to address. You're not even concerned. You ain't addressing nothing. Like, you like, okay. You know what I'm saying? Y'all over here elevating. It's elevation time. You you done did the work. You done fought this fight. And here go this conversation trying to come in. Barbara, this is Shirley Convo. Come and do your shadow work. So this karmic energy and or your person's person, current, whoever, could be trying to come in and cause you some type of emotional something. You know, some trying to nitpick or being petty or some shit like that. Y'all so far gone past this kind of shit that they finna waste their time trying to do that. Y'all over here living y'all damn lives. It been time for y'all to live y'all lives, Virgo. What's that on the... Closer to my dreams? Yeah. Y'all are focusing on elevation. Virgo. 
Elevation time. Closer to your dreams. That's just period. Y'all not concerned about Barbara or Shirley or Susie or none of them. <laughs> this shit is funny. All right, Virgo. Let's see what's going on. We're going to switch the deck, too, for y'all. I feel like somebody could have been trying to... They was tr Somebody could have been plotting in the background, Virgo. Trying to plan and plot and strategize. And they can't even get their own shit together trying to plot and, plot and strategize on you. Shit not even going how it's supposed to go in their own life. <laughs> and you just sitting back like, okay. And y'all trying to do what for what? I already seen that. I predicted that. What do you... What? That's supposed to happen. And I'm not a group past that. Virgo, y'all done grew past some shit like, what the hell? Y'all too damn woke. <laughs> Give us some more messages, spirit. Thank you. Somebody could miss your friendship here. This could be a friend missing your friendship. I feel like you shut some shit down here, Virgo, and somebody could be in their feelings, but I feel like you had to move forward in your life for a lot of different reasons, Virgo. Okay, so... These you ain't even these is old friends. This could be that could be trying to cause you some type of problem. Some people you don't even deal with no more. And or a lover. I feel like this could be a lover. This your person's person's whoever. Give us more energy on it. For Virgo. Yep, like I said. Y'all not even focused on nothing from the past, Virgo. It says your true love is here. You will be in union soon. So y'all are embracing union with a new soulmate here. I'm hearing that y'all got replacement soulmates here. See, that's how people don't know. That's how the universe works. When one twin don't work, another one will. The universe out cold like that. Oh, you don't want to act right? Boop. There you go. It says, shut that sacral down, celebrate, celibacy, heal your yoni. So, somebody is needing to shut down their sacral chakra. Somebody could still be having sex with somebody, okay? That could, you wasting your time or somebody not serving you a purpose, my love. Like, you can't continue to have sex with an energy that is taking your energy, causing problems in your life. Y'all got to remember that y'all vaginas are portals, Okay, those are portals, okay? Magical portals. Those are not to be tampered with in ways that these men be trying to tamper with y'all. Like, all that old shit and all that abuse and all that, oh, you gonna give me some when I want it, all that dominant shit. No. Hell no. Nah. No, Virgo. Period. Y'all start treating y'all, start treating your sacred garden like it's a sacred garden because it is start treating it treating it as such and make others do the same as well or they don't need to be around you they need to respect you on every level virgo that means mentally physically spiritually emotionally they can't do that they don't need to be in your life and the most high gonna make sure they don't be in your life y'all know that already Somebody could be in nostalgia. Think somebody is definitely thinking about you. They this, somebody want to talk to you, Virgo. Show me what I need to see for the sign of Virgo spirit, please and thank you. I changed the deck, y'all. I'm an astrology deck for y'all, Virgo. Thank you, Scorpio. It says, the evolution of man and woman. Allow transformation to enter your life. You will transform not only yourself, but others as well. So a lot of y'all are going through like a transformation phase here. Okay, y'all have transformed y'all life and a lot of y'all have elevated, okay? It's a lot of changes here. Dip changes, different spaces, different faces, Virgo, okay? these This is new beginnings here. I'm getting that. Thank you, Spirit. For Virgo. For Virgo. It could feel like it's coming slow for some of y'all, but it's coming, okay? Be patient. It's not saying that it's going to come any slower. It's about to, it, things are speeding up for y'all. Okay, so be patient, Virgo. 
I'm only saying that because I'm getting a stagnant. Thank you. Get moving. All right. So somebody, some people could be needing to um, some people could be needing to take action here. Okay. Just for some of y'all. Some of y'all have already taken action. All right. It says stimulate your lymphatic, your lymph Fatic system to remove toxins walking swimming and yoga will do a trick so um i feel like some of y'all are working out right now and y'all tapping into y'all chakras through um through like cardio you know what i'm saying things of that nature okay and if you're not a few of y'all need to start working out and getting that blood flowing okay we got family ties here celebratory excuse me celebratory celebratory energy surround you and your family so plan that special get together so somebody could be planning a get together and or if somebody's trying to plan something here they need to go ahead and take action for virgo Okay, so some of y'all may be feeling like some doors didn't open up or some things didn't happen how they how y'all wanted them to happen. <clears throat> That's why it's important to use your discernment and use your intuition. Because y'all gonna know when the door closed on y'all, if that's a door y'all ain't supposed to go through, you know. Rejection is your protection. If that door closed on you, you was not supposed to go through that door. So that's how y'all got to start looking at that. And I also feel like some of y'all already are looking at things in that way. Like y'all already know when some shit ain't working out, it wasn't supposed to. And, and then some of y'all could have high expectations and y'all expecting something to happen a certain way. Gotta show you otherwise, honey. Don't make plans. Okay, don't ever make plans on the Most High because the Most High will do the thing that's supposed to be done, but do it how he want to do it. <laughs> okay, so that's why I don't even be trying to make plans. I just allow things to happen. I, I, I'll i think a thought through like, okay, that's something I want to do and I'm going to try to get it done. But making plans, not on this journey, honey, because things will happen just not right when you want them to happen and that be our problem sometimes and then they'll be like divine timing divine timing you'll be like we sick of divine timing i get it virgo show me what i need to see some of y'all could be into old r&b old 90s music that's that good music virgo okay it says something to talk about it says, use your verbal skills to heal old wounds. Your power now lies within your words. So choose them wisely. Okay, so like I was said, like I was saying, somebody could have been gossiping about you. And then the next card is uh shake it off, absorbing too much negative energy. So y'all could be dealing with rumors and or somebody could be gossiping. These are things you could get intuitively through your gifts, or somebody could um actually be coming to you with some gossip. I cannot stand a bone carrier. Don't let nobody bring no bones to you, okay? First of all, you're gifted. A lot of y'all are. Use, use your discernment when people are trying to come and talk to you or have a conversation with you, Virgo. 1818 could be very significant to y'all. So look 1818 up for y'all situation, Virgo. Take some time out, get on YouTube or Google or whatever, and look up the angel number 1818. That's very significant for y'all. Okay, so somebody could definitely be gossiping or something like that or spreading rumors. I'm definitely getting somebody could be trying to spread rumors or speak up some lies about y'all. It's always somebody trying to do something. People can't just relax. Like we, we coming into like for some of y'all that celebrate the holidays. We're coming into the holidays. Ain't nobody got time for all that. People trying to actually find a peace. Or some of y'all is at peace. And y'all not allowing none of that drama shit into y'all life, Virgo. I don't know why people even trying it. I'm not finna argue with you. We not finna talk about nothing. What is there to talk about? It was just straight cutting people off. Bye. No. Mm -mm. Talk about who? If I'm if I'm talking to you, that means you I'm giving you my energy, right? I cannot stand this lip gloss. My bad, y'all. 
y'all don't give nobody y'all energy. That's just period. All right. I feel like a lot of y'all... <clears throat> I feel like it was some doors closed with an energy here. Something got shut down, an ending here, something that needed to happen here. So they're wanting y'all to express gratitude and show gratitude because a lot of y'all lives were saved. Okay, so don't sit and be like, well, why they choose me or why they pick me to do this? This is hard. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. No, y'all need to be thankful. Okay. Be thankful for these changes that's happening for y'all. Don't ever let this journey get y'all to where y'all like, oh, I don't want to do this or I shouldn't. No. Do the journey. Don't let the journey do you. Okay. You are your own boss. Be in control of yourself. Be in control over your emotions. Nothing on the external could. My nose going to start itching. Nothing on the external external should be able to affect y'all okay what should have been affecting y'all is y'all not being able to move out of y'all own way because it's just as soon as y'all knew that y'all had this divine protection y'all was supposed to have been working on yourselves because nothing on the external should be able to affect you that's why we have um techniques available like shadow work and self-mastery work tap into that virgo okay because i'm hearing some of y'all need to do some shadow work here some of y'all could be getting triggered by certain stuff don't be letting this external shit trigger y'all for real do y'all shadow work because a lot of that shit fake it doesn't matter it's an illusion it's a lie a lot of this shit was built on black magic most of this shit is black magic like what y'all see is what y'all really seeing that's intuitively y'all discernment. Trust that shit, just period. I don't care what it looked like on the outside. I don't care what it looked like on this 3D. We know what it looked like on the 5D. Things that hasn't quite manifested into this 3D. So yeah, people think they doing little slick shit underneath the surface when you can, you're a seer. Your third eye open. So you already see what people planning and what they doing and what they finna do. And you don't even be caring for real. It's just some shit that come to you. It's like, y'all, they don't miss a beat for y'all, Virgo. Y'all ancestors spend several blocks for y'all. Y'all are highly protected. Okay, let's get y'all a closing message. Somebody needs y'all. Somebody don't want y'all to take y'all love away. I feel like y'all out here being rebels with, with causes here. The wounded healer. Because y'all can see. It says, I can see clearly now. It says, channel your desire to go against the grain, join a humanitarian group, or start one yourself. So, some of y'all, I'm feeling like Virgo. Some of y'all are, um, I'm not finna tell all y'all business on here. But some of y'all are tapped into some type of group or something like that that y'all are brainstorming and coming up with some different things. Because people watch my channel, I don't want nobody taking y'all ideas. But I'm definitely getting... It's going to be some expansion behind. It's going to be very successful. So if you were thinking about building something, go ahead and do it. I'm not going to tell all y'all business on this video because this is public. But it says, I can see clearly now the fog is lifting. You will soon have the answers you need to make an informed decision. So somebody needs to make a decision here. And I feel like a lot of y'all already got the information that y'all need to fully move forward from a situation and or make a decision to expand. You know what I'm saying, Virgo? All right. I love you all so much. I'm going to get out of here. Y'all get out here and get grounded on this beautiful Saturday. And make sure y'all taking care of yourselves. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Comment down below if these messages are resonating for you. If not, say Grand Rising. Say hello. All right, y'all. Move, move in the energy of love because that's all we have. Okay? It's so much hate in the world. So, so many people are battling with being insecure and battling with anxiety and battling with depression and, and, and identity crisis. You know what I'm saying? Be grateful that that's not you. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people that are dealing with things underneath the surface that we can't see. You know what I'm saying? You send them prayers. You send them healing. You send them love and light. Okay? Because... A lot of these people are not at peace within themselves. And that's why you can't allow their projection of themselves to try to dim your light. No. Y'all continue to be in, be authentic. Continue to stand in your authenticity. Okay? Don't let nobody try to shadow that shit at all. Like, uh, no, you won't dim my light over here, not over here. Okay? <laughs> 
Y'all be positive. Think positive. Y'all are alchemists. Y'all are manifesting. When you think negative shit, negative, you bring negative shit in. No, we not in that energy, Virgo. Okay. Take care of yourselves.